Luke and the Bully has been missing for just over two weeks and we now know that information has emerged that informs us that two men were seen in that area acting strangely and this was reported to the police. They were seen at approximately around 7.45am on that morning and they were said to have fishing rods and the man reporting them said that they were covering their faces and he thought that they were acting suspicious and they felt uncomfortable and weird and reported this to the police. However, the police did not take any statements from the witness for nine days let that sink in that is nine days that everyone was focusing on the water looking for Nicola and that included the expert search and rescue team also who came in to comb the river area now we also know that a red van has been spotted in that area and reported by a neighbour twice and we now also have been informed that there is a local garage that will be handing their CCTV footage over to the police so that they can look at the information that is on there and this will give them information on an exit on that field that they hadn't looked at before and that it will check the cars on the road and any that came in or out of the garage on that morning. It is also believed they are looking for the previous day before Nicola went missing to see if there are anything that is suspicious on there, any cars, anyone that may have followed Nicola. So as you can see, there is lots of information that is now being pulled together and maybe that the focus on the river was not the right place. The police are still working on that hypothesis, but obviously working on these new leads. Hopefully these new leads are tying together and that we will get some answers soon in the disappearance of Nicola for her family. And we hope that we can reunite them with her loved ones.